Hey, what's up, guys? Welcome back. It's your girl, Jazz, and I'm excited to try these hopefully delicious Pringles. Uh, when it comes to uh, mimicking other foods, they've been kind of skeptical on them, although nine times out of ten, they're, so, they're at least reasonably close. I wouldn't say they're, you know, exact matchings, but they seem to get it pretty close, which is kind of interesting to think about. But today we are trying out Wendy's Baconator Pringles, so I'm excited about trying these. So, of course, as always, we like to try and do the nutritional facts, um, since I know it's not really healthy. We're talking about potato chips here, guys. Um, I'm going to go ahead and just provide a tier. Actually, too bad. 15, 15 crisps or chips per serving. Not too bad, although I don't really count how many chips I put in my mouth as I'm eating them. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and try this out. I don't smell nothing so far. I'm trying to identify the smell. Ironically enough, I kind of smell mayo. I know over the bacon and everything like that. I don't know, maybe my mind's playing tricks on me. That's kind of what I smell which is weird. All right, so we got our chips. Looks like there's more um, seasoning on one side versus the other. Tastes more like ham rather than, I mean, I, I know that they're both come from the same animal, which I don't really want to think about that, <laughs> but to me, bacon and ham have two different tastes to it. I'm used to, I like my bacon where it's like that nice, that crispy bite into it and it kind of just, just crumbles. I, I don't like where it's, to me it's uncooked and it's still loose and rubbery-ish, but that's what it kind of tastes like. And it's not bad, but if I'm comparing it to a Baconator, it's not what I would imagine. Yeah, it tastes more like ham. I don't even taste any cheese to it. No, like the burger patty to it. None of that. It just tastes like ham. But like I said, it's kind of good in a way. <laughs> And it seems like the more you eat of these, the better they taste. <laughs> but still, as far as a Baconator, it don't taste like a Baconator at all. Not at all. But I will continue to eat these chips because they're good. <laughs> Overall, as far as just potato chips in general, their flavor, I give it a four out of a four. No, I'd say a three and a half out of five. Just because it's it's different, but it's not bad. Now, as far as it actually tasting like a Baconator, I'd have to give it a one and a half because it, to me, it does not taste at all or even smell like bacon for that matter. Maria, more than likely, you're gonna be one of the first commenters on this video. So before you, well, by the time you watch this video, it's already going to be too late. <laughs> I got to know what your opinion is on these chips. Cause I know, I, I know the comments that you like, and of course you're coming on just about every single food <laughs> video that I drop. So I definitely got to know what your opinion are on these. Surprising enough, I found these chips at CVS and they were on sale too. So if you don't know where to find them, that might be a little helpful clue. You have a local one not sure how your area is but yes i want to know what you guys opinions are on the wendy's baconator because to me it just tastes like ham but that's what it reminds me of now that i'm thinking about it i'm thinking about <clears throat> when i was a kid having a ham sandwich with miracle whip on it 
and having chips on it, that's what it kind of tastes like to me. If you want more of a mental picture to it, that's what these chips taste like my childhood. <laughs> I know I'm not the only one that had that, that type of sandwich, so you guys have got to let me know um, whether you agree with me, you disagree, whether you like these or not, and whether it tastes like just a ham sandwich with chips on it. <laughs> Alright guys, make sure that you subscribe for more of my craziness on Jazzy Reviews, my other YouTube channel, as well as this one, Jazzy Foods. In the meantime, stay tuned and stay jazzy. Thanks for watching, guys!